Hey everyone, welcome to my video. With budget bills for easy to get arena bonus heroes, this time we have five. Lancer Rinea from the Tempest Trial, Pane from Grand Hero Battle, Pala and Laszlo from the 3 and 4 star summoning pool, and the free hero Anna. I've already done one of these for Pane and one for Anna. We can find them here. Laszlo is a red sword infantry hero. He has good attack, okay defense, and bad speed and resistance. He comes with Silver Sword, Noontime, Axe Breaker, and Hunt Speed. Laszlo is a hero with interesting stats that can work both as an aggressive hero and as a physical tank, but his base weapon makes him pretty bad for a budget build. If you still want to build him, I give him the Defense or Resistance Refinement for his weapon, give him Reposition, sub his special for Ignis or Bonfire, raise an Attack Defense, Attack Defense Bond, or Steady Stance for the A slot, Renewal or Vantage for the B slot, Attack Smoke for the C slot, and Close Defense or Steady Stance for the Seal. Laszlo will work decently as a tank, and deal decent damage too. He'll be doubled by most enemies though. If you want to invest in him, giving him Steady Breath or Safe Card will help him a lot, or give him Brave Sword with an aggressive build. Pala is a Red Sword Flyer hero. She has okay attack, and mediocre speed, defense, and resistance. She comes with White Wing Blade with the Triangle Adept effect, and a refinement that gives her a buff and the Brave Weapon effect as long as there's two more flyers within two spaces of Pala. She also comes with Moonbow, Wings of Mercy, and Goat Flyers. Pala's weapon makes her a great counter for green enemies, as she can both tank them and kill them with ease. But it also makes her not great as a bonus hero, as she won't be able to kill most blue enemies. Also, I wouldn't use her outside of a flyer team. I give her an aggressive build for high damage, and cancel affinity on the B slot so she can actually kill blue enemies. With some buffs from her team, Pala will have enough stats to kill most enemies. She'll still struggle against tanky blue enemies though. You can also play a tankier build if you don't really care about killing blues. Fury, Vantage, and Abrasion Seal will give her a lot of stats, and Pala will work great as a dual phase unit. Linea is a blue tone infantry dancer. She has okay attack and speed, but defense and mediocre resistance. She comes with Silver Goblet, granting her the Distant Guard effect to buff nearby allies. She also comes with Dance, Bracing Blow, and Fire Flood Dance. Linnea, like most dancers, is a good support hero, and her weapon makes her even better at that. But she's awful at killing enemies, so she won't really work as a bonus hero unless you invest a lot in her. So if you care about your score, don't use her. Otherwise, for the support build, I give her Iceberg or Glacies, any buff for the C slot and a Tactics or Drive buff for the Seal. Maybe swap her V skill for Wings of Mercy, unless you're pairing her with a Blade Tomb user. Rinea is really cool, but she's not a killer. Thank you for watching the video! Please consider subscribing, liking, commenting and sharing, it always helps me. Here you can check out my schedule for the week. You can follow me here to see when I post new videos. And here you can find some of my other videos. Or you can go to my main YouTube page where I have everything organized. I really hope you enjoyed and see you next time!